The Biodesign Innovation subject was originally conceived by Stanford University just over a decade ago when it was seen that there is a need to develop medical technologies to solve clinical needs. I think a vital part of the course is the collaboration between the biomedical engineering students and the MBA students. This is partly because of the different expertise that the two groups of students have and putting them together in a team achieves more than the students could achieve separately. We partnered with uh, Dr. Christian Tedder from the Royal Women's Hospital, who was absolutely fantastic in giving us access to the NICU and helping us identify what she thought were a range of different problems. The new device Nevi is developing will help the operator at the time of placement to get some easy to interpret real-time feedback of where the catheter tip is while the catheter is being advanced. So this is a new concept using ECG transmitted through the catheter. So this will not only hopefully increase the success rate, uh, but also save time and money, but more importantly also decrease the stress for the newborns undergoing the procedure and potentially reduce the radiation for catheter when the catheter position is being checked. We started off with a little bit of equity from the founders, so that, that was around about $15,000. Um, but since then we probably won another in the order of $120,000 to $150,000 through different prizes. And recently we were accepted into the first cohort for the MedTech Actuator, which is Australia's largest medical device accelerator program, which comes with some seed funding, which will really, really help us in 2018 as we progress our idea. Our own vision is to create this medical device that can really help save the lives of these newborns. You know, there's 1.1 million uh, misplaced or migrated catheters in the world. It's over a $650 million problem. And for us to really be given the opportunity to help these babies across the world, it's been phenomenal for us, really. I think Nevi as a company also has the potential to probably go beyond this initial goal and uh, establish themselves and make a mark as a young Australian biomedical device company.